Hey too, what's up? It's first chapter, so I know this video has been long awaited, but here it is, my sticker supply video and slash setup. Um so as you're seeing right now, my room is pretty big. I don't want to sh show you more, but my work area is actually um what used to be a walk-in small closet. I uh, turned it into my work area because had a lot of art stuff and uh, it was really taking up like a lot of my wall space in my actual room for my actual personal stuff not just my art and um, I wanted a space to be just for myself and uh, I found that this area uh, was perfect it was nice and small and um, I could actually fit a lot of things in here so um, yeah I kind of turned it in turned this into my work area it's perfect it's surrounded by art everywhere um as i'm showing you it's a little it's kind of like a little cubicle sort of um here's the room uh you walk in there's art pretty much on every wall uh you know still have a lot of room to to fill it up so I definitely will do that here's a big one of my favorite blue top collabs that i don't think i can ever get rid of um it's beautiful <laughs> I love it, um, so you know I don't care if y'all y'all give me shit for that, but I don't think I'm ever gonna get rid of that. It's not sticked on. It's just I used to bump stack. I say it's still, it's not peeled. So maybe I decide to get rid of it and put it up. Maybe I can do that. So yeah, just art everywhere. Um, I'm actually oh, there's some pieces up there. Um, I actually wanted to show you all where my art space was at because a lot of you all have uh, asked me like where exactly is your your desk and stuff so my desk is right here it's actually not a desk it's just a like a piece of wood that was cut to fit these two sides perfectly and uh, a plastic that was fit that was the same size as the as the wood that was also cut to um, to measurement by my uncle so that was pretty cool so yeah I just have art pretty much everywhere you know so I just really wanted to show you um, all that before I actually get down and show you everything uh, that has to do with my supplies so this is my setup portion of this video so I'm just gonna go ahead and start showing you all my supplies that I have on my desk um, and let's start here. So I have these two little like bins right here. Yeah, these are all fine lines. Uh, Stabilos, uh, Sharpies, Crayolas, big fine lines. And then I have Stabilos, which are the best, I think. These are the best fine lines. They don't bleed. These are awesome. And then I have uh, these Prismacolor fine lines. These are just fine lines there. Down here are all really cheap markers. Uh, Dollar General stores. Um, Dollar Tree, 99 cent store, anywhere that I can find cheap markers, they're right there. And then obviously my favorite Crayolas. Uh, moving on to this little trash can bin that I bought at Blick Studio Art, uh, which is my local art store. Uh, I have all white markers, honestly. It's nothing big major, just Sharpie paints, Molotovs, and uh, like Craft Smart, which is a cheap brand of paint markers. And this ceramic little jar that says F1 on it that my friend made for me. I have these uh, brand new Bix. These are pretty much what I use um, on all my stickers. I have the little, this little trash can right here. Um, got that at dollar store. It's all to stick it up. You know, sharpener, some stamps here. A row of stickers that I also use as a container for my black. All my general black markers, Sharpies, Molotovs. Uh, really cheap paint markers, the uh, scissors, you know, just honestly the general sort of Sharpie paints. Uh, any type of black marker I have in here, that's what I use. Uh, my pencil, now this is my favorite section, <laughs> the top one. Just paint markers, all type of paint markers that I have. Primarily use Sharpie paints. Uh, I have one Molotov in there, um, some decos, that's pretty much all I use is decos and Sharpie paints. Uh, down here is Prismacolors and Blick Studio Paint Markers and a couple Copics you can see there. Um, 
Now I'm going up right here. I have this little uh, money giraffe that I need to do. This little another sharpener that looks like that's a world down here in the back. Um, don't want to do a lot of movement here, but you know, just some things to read and look at. Um, and then here I have another container. I have some old. Oh, I have a lot of shit. This is why I didn't want to move stuff. Okay, some prints, old prints, some big, big ones like these, and metallic markers like these. Just metallic markers and mini metallic markers. Uh, down below, I have refillable. Why is it shaking? Okay, I don't want to really open it, but here's all just black black markers that if they don't fit here they go here uh black book little small sketchbook this is where i take this is the one i take everywhere i go uh so i can sketch on the on the, on the road here is nothing um as you can see i'm just surrounded by art um i want to go up here take these out these are spray cans and then just farms, question Josh, uh, Bobble Ring, Soul, and Mr. Say. There's a note back, there's a, a lid from, that I did. Um, this is fake money. Um, yeah, that's pretty much, that's pretty much, oh, I forgot this little container here. It's actually like a mailbox. I don't know if you can see it. Got this for a dollar at Target. So that was my desk. Now I'm gonna go ahead and continue with the bins and all this stuff that I have because I do have a lot of stuff. But here's this little four um, desk thing, or not desk, but why can I think of a drawer? There you go. So pretty big drawer. First drawer is basically all stickers. Here I have my stickers that I've made. I have a couple combos ready. Um, just pretty much 228s, uh, thermals, some blanks from the UK, I think. More labels, a couple blue tops, um, a CD that I'm gonna do on that doesn't have anything, it's all scratched. Um, just a variety of stickers. Um, yeah, there's a couple of tweets in there. Just random shit that I have of stickers. And uh, these are collab I need to do. And then here are blank uh, sheets of UPS. Um, it's basically blank sheets of paper and more sticker paper. That's for sure. Second drawer. <clears throat> it's all shipping stuff. Envelopes. Back then you send out tomato. More shipping stuff. Not important. Third one, it's not important. My fourth one is where I have all my paint. I have to move all shit. Oh. So or I have colored pencils in here too. Uh paintbrushes. That one. And just you know you can't see that, but all acrylics and paint. Nothing special, really cheap paint and also I got it all there for free, so and these motor tubes there and then more thermos and then these rolls um yeah okay so moving on to this bin right here here i have collabs and you send out here i have stickers from other people and obviously they're covered up with stickers nothing in that drawer i'm not gonna even bother my trash can oh I have these bins up here so you can all see so I have these another level up here I guess um, these bins here are also all thermal stickers and up there it's U USPS uh, stickers the 11 B's uh, so it's the bigger ones the big bigger one stickers the bigger stickers what the hell can you speak um okay, so now turning around from my desk I have more bins uh, here I have canvases and cardboards in that one. Just canvases and cardboard. 
I'm a hoarder or envelopes from people that when they send me stuff, uh, I just put it here. You know, I just can't get rid of them. Just can't. Down here, I have old canvases and a new one. And these old ones I'm actually going to cover up because I want to do something with them. Probably do my new character on them and sell them. Here I have caps. Caps. I'll use some caps and then I have my cans. You know, some orange art, fresh paint, some flame, some Montana gold, some cheap dollar paint, more fresh paint here, iron lax, more gold, and a Montana. And there was a lot of shit, so I need to actually hurry up and get going because. This video is too long, but almost done. Just one more section. Uh, some old boxes full of shit that I don't even know what's in there. Paper on this one. Electronics on this one. Like old cameras that don't fucking work. And then I really don't know what's in there. And then this box contains like old ink and mops. I think that's everything that's in there. Yeah, so old inks that and mops that are probably dried up now. Let me throw that away. Um, and then here I have more containers, more green containers. Yay! Ugh. But should I take it down? Oh, fuck it. See what y'all make me do. See what y'all make me do. Anyways, here I have refillable paint markers, black markers, and fine line bags. All on sale, guys. I buy everything on sale, so I'm a cheap ass again. Here I have things to make backgrounds with. Yay! It's pretty cool backgrounds on stickers and canvases, which I rarely do. And then this one. It's a pretty heavy one. Oh, sorry. all my block print printing stuff. So I my little roller thingy, a couple of block prints that are basically old. I actually like this one. It took me forever, but I like it. Might use this still. Might not. You know, you never know. Yeah, oops. Ink. Ink, ink, ink. Ink, ink, ink to black prints. Now let me put it back while I'll talk to you about those books right there are more black books. Um, or sketchbooks or whatever you all like to call them uh, the two spiral notebook looking ones are the new black books on st I started well actually this is my original my first black book ever of stickers new sticker black book Ugh. I already did a video on it don't ask and then here's the new sticker black book that's already done um, I know a lot of you may not be a fan of black books, but I am, so. Yeah. Yeah, yeah so. Some of you might not be fans of sticker black books, but I am. And I have them, so. Y'all want to see this? Y'all don't better not be commenting about. Uh, whatever. This is the new one. Alright, so I think that's it, everybody. Yeah, I'm just. Yeah, that's it. I'm finally finished. Alright everybody, so thank you all for watching this video. It took a long time to record it and uh, to get it off for you because, you know, I'm kind of lazy. But before anything, the biggest message I want to get out is that I pay for every single thing that you saw in this video. Every little thing that I have bought, I have bought or have gotten it for free. So please keep that in mind when you're doing stickers. Keep it honest, keep it real. Comment, rate, subscribe, stay fresh. Stay dope, stay honest, and uh, peace out, everybody.